Glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Two teams make it to the arena. Only one is able to celebrate. Tonight, one of these two teams will bring home a national championship. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA College Football Action coming up next with Brad and Kirk on the call. David and I will see you at halftime. National Championship game. And now let's head down to the coin toss. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. We'll see how this game plays out as they get ready for the opening kickoff. The kick is away and the National Championship is underway. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So they're just about set to get the game going again. Notre Dame is up by three. And he's tackled at the 26. Six-yard line. Sometimes when you've got speed, that's all you need. It's the one thing you just can't defend. I got one. I got one. Mike 56. Mike 56. He's down. He's down. Check three. Check three. Check three. Yellow line. Check three. He'll get it again. And down he goes. Right around the 34. From their own 34 yard line. Second down. He's tackled at about the 41. That's good for a game of seven yards. That'll make it good. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. Mike 56, Mike 56. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Throws quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. Carlisle was the intended target on the play. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. Newsom is waiting for the snap. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. With the pass incomplete. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 34. with a 
defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack, but somehow he's able to throw the ball away. Five wide. Sacked. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. That's what happened there. So no luck on that drive as they go three and out. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. will be the return man. Oh, excellent punt. He makes it out to maybe the 39-yard line. The Trojan staff has got a winner on their hands. You've been around kids like this. They're just fun to be around. They're fun to be around, and I think it's infectious. His attitude, I think, uh, permeates throughout this entire offense and really uh, throughout the entire team. There's, it's no wonder this team is so competitive with him at the, at the front leading the way. From their own 39-yard line, second down, Notre Dame holds a field goal lead. Run to the left there. And he's got it. He might have a chance. And they make the stop at the 21. That's a tough catch for the receiver on a ball coming in from that angle. But he did a really nice job of looking it into his hands and concentrating all the way. to get out of trouble, but he can't shake the defense. Well, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. Second and long, ball on the 28th. with room to work. Tackle made around the nine-yard line. Number 22 brings him down at the nine-yard line. That makes it first and goal. Man, that's trash. That's trash. Watch, watch 40, watch 40. Check out, dude. Watch, 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 watch. Check 50, check 50. He steps out at the five-yard line. Notre Dame has a three-point lead. And he's taken down at the two-yard line. The three yard line. Fourth down. This isn't much more than an extra point. Kicks away, and he got it. Even though they gave up the field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Brought down at the 23-yard line. This 
deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. Action. Good protection. Throws it in a hurry. They'll bring him down right around the 46-yard line. And they couldn't hook up on that one. You know, Brad, this is one of those plays where the quarterback just wants to apologize to the wide receiver and maybe every other member of this offense. But the wide receiver, if he's smart, will come up to that quarterback, tell him to forget about it. Let's move on to the next play. They go with the screen here, and the halfback's got it. And he shoved out of bounds at the 40-yard line. They're coming after this part. And he's got to be happy with that punt, Kirk. Yeah, Brad, that was nice. So now they're looking at a long way to go to even think about a score. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Notre Dame, up six. Ten. And he gains around three on that keeper. Good speed off the edge by the sophomore to come up and make the hit. Our national championship game is one quarter away from naming the number one team in the country. Our score, 27-21, Fighting Irish. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Mike 56, Mike 56. Scrambling around. Runs with it, and he's got room. That's a great tackle at the 16-yard line. That's a game of six on the play. That'll bring that third and inches. It looked like the defense might have been expecting the pitch on the option, but instead the quarterback kept it and converted here on third down. Mike 56, Mike 56. He's on the run. And he's tackled around the 34-yard line. And he has a huge gain. Yeah, I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off. Ends up with a great run. Throws incomplete. Accuracy is such a vital part of being a quarterback. You've got to have an ability to lay the ball right into your guys' hands. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Notre Dame is up by six. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's good for a gain of four yards. Step 
It's out of bounds. Around the 38-yard line. Harris is the deep man awaiting the return. He fields a punt at the 20. He makes it to the 28-yard line. The Trojans have just not been able to get that offense rolling at all today. I think they're confused. I think it starts up front with the offensive line. They're not having the typical game that you'd expect to see from them as far as communication. I think it's affected the rest of the offense. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Throws a bullet. And he tackles him hard at the 43. This is a great pitch and catch combination. And they hook up here for a big time game. And he's tackled after positive yardage. seven points. The score now, 28-27. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. Well, this one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both teams are kind of struggling to take control of this game. Obviously, they're both very, very competitive with one another. It just seems that the lead is going back and forth between the two teams. Man up, man up. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Dumps it complete the tight end over the middle. And they make the stop around the 37-yard line. Got it on the screen, and he hits him hard at the 44. Here's 
screen pass. Gets it to the back. He's knocked out of bounds at the 43-yard line. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. The middle for a nice game. That's where you fly to the ball. A game of seven yards. Fires across the middle. Tackle made at the 22 yard line. up a screen. Tailback's got it, and he's taken down right around the 20. Last at the 20-yard line. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on the 20-yard line. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. Mike 56. Mike 56. Nice run there. So the quarterback keeps it for about seven yards. So the defense has had enough of the no huddle as they call a timeout. And this play is number eight on the drive. He scrambled. Well, a lot of frustration by that offense, but you've got to give the defense credit for coming up with a stop in this quarter in a game this close. Line it up for the field goal. Kicks up, and it's through the uprights. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 22. USC's coaches have got to be confident in the fact that they've got a star player in a tight situation. And there's nothing better than having a quarterback you have confidence in in these kind of situations. You know he's going to make the right read. He's going to give his receivers a chance to make a play on the ball. And they're going to have a really good chance of moving the ball down the field to have a shot to win this game. We have less than a minute to go. Red two. Kill, kill, kill. Yellow three. Go. Yellow three. Go. Looks like someone got a head start on the line. False start. Offense. You got to be careful to avoid these. Penalties are a great Still way to stall down. out a drive. Second down. Eight Red yards to go. Ball on the 24. And he just gets rid of it. Davis gets it on the inside. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. from the defense. They come up with the stop of the day and that'll ice this football game. Notre Dame is the national champion. 
Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. Notre Dame made the journey and finished it off with the national championship. It really couldn't have happened to a better bunch of kids in a classier school than this. They battled all year. Whenever it got tough, they came together and came out on top. And now they're on top of the polls, the world, everything. Congratulations to our national champions. Take a look at our choice for today's player of the game. He made a big contribution to his team's win. For the Fighting Irish, they rack up their 12th win of the season. And for USC, they'll close out what's been a good season with a disappointing loss.